What is everyone doing? Welcome back. Here we go, John. One Raging Nerd. Original Zilla, what's up? Manuel Carvalho, welcome back, guys. Fast Crab, Cabal Gang. Let's go. Uh, yeah, uh, I'm not feeling very well. I, I have not slept uh, a lot. So, starting a little bit late. Trying to cut on sugar and getting some uh, withdrawal symptoms. Okay, so we have to do a quick Alliance Wars. We are facing the Black Vengeance. Is this your Alliance, Raging Nerd, or uh, you are another Alliance? Ram, welcome back. Matthew, 3088 Gaming, welcome back. God Slammed in Crucible. Little Falker. Nightcrawler, Fast Grab. How are you guys doing? You guys got to clap at the Crucible. I actually crushed my, my opponent. Really nice score against my first opponent. So the guy was only able to clear four rooms. So that's definitely a solid win. Even with my multiple attacks per room. It wasn't so bad. John, good with gold? Or good with training materials, not with gold? I'm trying to keep my gold at 20 million just in case. Next week we should get the new character, but we don't have the war payout. So you're gonna be lacking in gold. That's why I'm trying to save. But uh, how are you guys feeling the, the new season so far? Do you guys have like problems clearing all rooms or were you able to clear all rooms? Salvatore, welcome to the chat. Scene pool, welcome back. I actually managed to sleep eight hours. I think I slept uh, in the last four days, probably average two hours per day. It's already very, very hot in Hungary. Very, very hot. And uh, I don't deal uh, very well with hot. At night, it's 17 degrees. During the day, it's already like 30 Celsius, of course. You are in the suns. Pegasus in room 2 won me the trial. My opponent couldn't clear it. Otherwise, uh, would lose. Yeah, I'm afraid of facing like uh, Pegasus on room 2 and, and not get lucky. Yesterday, I was able to clear it. Got lucky. But I'm not sure about it. Two wins in a row already. With my defense. Awesome, man. Awesome. Congratulations. Little Falcon won easy. Awesome. Shekari Gaming, welcome back. Sasuke, welcome back. You lost CC again. You got up too high. And now it's uh, it's balancing out. Okay. Uh, let's do a quick offer review. Oops. What is this? And then I have to do what attacks. And then I have to do the, the other thing. Okay, here we are. Let's refresh the, the story. So we got some new data mines, but uh, I already I was already checking the data mines. We had the game downloading some assets. I thought it was going to be something something important because of the um, the maintenance that we have soon. But no, it's just an event for this guy and his own specific orb. And there is something flying in in my kitchen. I think I'm gonna get pissed off soon. VHS Rogue, welcome back. Dr. Elmut, Arena Tax. Yeah, Arena Tax soon. Okay, so let's move on. We don't have any gold here. Sometimes they give offer here with uh, 13 orbs. That's pretty decent, not today. Free claims, let's go. At this time, the server doesn't lag. It's great. Level 100 Gambit, yeah. Yeah, it seems like the opponent I faced yesterday, he was commenting on my video and uh, my extreme in room uh, 2 caused him a lot of problems. Happy F, Mr. Artgrave Day. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, extreme in room 1, but also extreme in room 2. If they are big enough, they, it seems that they are also scary. At, le at least that's the feedback my opponent gave. Okay, so we have some more offers for the, the Zombie Juggernaut. 
5 million gold plus 1000 training materials. I can see a lot of people buying this one. I can see a lot of people buying this one. 5 million gold is like what? $10? Then another $10 on training materials. Not the worst. Papa Woody, welcome back. Boy, welcome back. Every day is F art grip day. <laughs> One with 32,634 versus 32,629. Wow. Same defense. Yeah, so I, I did a change. I removed the, the, the leader from defense to offense just in case I face um, I have Mind Scroll. Because I was thinking about what options do I have against I have Mind Scroll, and I literally have no options. So because of that, uh, I, I had to change a little bit. Okay, so more zombie juggernaut offers. If you have this guy at uh, six or seven stars, it's a very good event. We have these offers for the war event. I told my alliance if to buy the, the $5 offer because you get uh, 6,000 points rather than just four. And that's more convenient to complete the event. T4s with points. If you want to try to exploit the, the leaderboard. And then the usual junk. Okay. Lots of training materials. You guys were saying the other day, and it's true. I don't remember who said it. But they have way more training material offers than gold offers. And uh, in my opinion, at least for me, I need uh, way more gold than training materials. Michael C, welcome back. Just easily punched up 600k. Pegasus into Extreme in, with Rogue in Room 2. I don't know, man. I don't know. The guy had the big numbers and uh, he was not able to clear it. Depends on the position. Depends on many things. And it's Rogue with Dazzler or is it Rogue with Cyclops or Rogue with uh, Sunspot? That also changes things around. Second Trial as well. They have Extreme on Room 2. So, I don't know, if uh, supposedly subject to change, if you use a big Pegasus, it works. I'm not sure if it's true. Do you know how to counter out of time in water? Yes, yes. We'll see if they have a chance of doing that. So, today we are facing Mr. Kennedy. We are getting lucky. We are, we are facing all the big boys in Crucible. Okay, let's see if you can attack this guy. Who the, who the hell is Time Twister? Time waster. What is time waster? I don't even know what that means. What team he has? We don't attack big Sparta. Since he's here, let's do it. Got Zugs to 7 red. Now at 500k. Oh my god, let's go. Nice. Woo Peter, welcome back. Happy affiliate anniversary. Is, is it? Thank you, I guess. Then scroll, leader, better ray, build, dorm. Yeah, I also switched those rooms around. Just to see if it lowers the efficiency of the opponent or not. So yeah, of course it needs some, some testing. I'll send you a SS. Does I have mind beat Pegasus in, uh, in two? No, no, absolutely not. We tried that yesterday and I got demolished. Chasefield, welcome back. Thank you very much. Daniel, welcome back. Your suggestions for CC room one in your video got me the win. They had to triple tap it. Awesome, man. Awesome. Congratulations. Yeah, Pathfinder he also won. Yes. Pathfinder also won. So there is a small chance that we face each other on the last day. And he got the easy guy, so we'll see. He got the easy guy, I got the hard guy. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, wow, these... I'm getting destroyed. So let's... Uh, we don't have the stun anymore. Let's try to delete these Robbie Rays. So they don't do more damage. Or is, they still do. Okay, they are mega ability blocker. I still have my scroll with good health. Seven red star scroll, please do something. Okay, let's rewind that uh, apocalypse. Uh, let's one shot this mofo. 
Yes, and now we're gonna wait a little bit. So yeah, we have a chance of facing Pathfinder. I didn't talk with him yet. If he wants to do a video or not, maybe later today I'll... Later today, no, tomorrow. I'll talk with him. But yeah, so far, it, so far, people are giving good feedback. There was someone in my alliance that said they got uh, obliterated using my defense. But once again, it depends on the size, depends on the position, depends on the diamonds. Diamonds, of course, very important. If you don't have a, a two diamond rogue or a two diamond forge, it's not going to be the same thing. Okay, so how we are doing on this event? Okay, so more training materials and leader shards. Soon, soon enough. Uh, so yeah, the, the new data mines that we got, it's also about the, the Spider B Parker event. And now that we had last week, it's the same. So we'll have to spend campaign energy. You'll have to, to blitz. I didn't check if you still need to spend isolate energy, but at least normal energy and uh, and blitzing. So I'm not sure how, how that pleases people. Probably not a lot, but two days of maximum blitzing. And we have no new blocks, right? No new blocks. Okay, let's go back. Let me see if I find uh, the clock. It's here. Okay. Oh, Joe Biden, what's up? Joe Biden coming up early. It's almost midnight, so he's getting ready. Okay, let's see. We have uh, 40 seconds left. The apocalypse is still halfway. Okay. Let's get ready. Why have fortifier? Okay, let's see. 20 seconds left. Okay, maybe I should try to attack now. I'm gonna wait for 40. Okay, here we go. 15 seconds left. Let's see if it's enough or not. Oof, it was enough. Okay. Should be fine. Jose Jimenez, welcome back. Rank 1. Ooh, this is very dangerous. Let's see if you're gonna get catapulted or not. It seems like not. It seems like not. Let's see. Uh, no power cores yet. You're gonna reset the game. And I have to be careful. Make sure it, after the war that attacks, I always reset so it doesn't bugs out. Blackhead Diamonds event, it was delayed. So maybe next month. From, from what I understood, you have one diamond event every month and two weeks. So if you're gonna have Zombie Juggernaut diamonds now, you can expect the Black Hat event to be in one month. And I assume you are asking this for the for the Spider-Man. Not really sure if Spider-Man Peter B. Parker, if he needs like super big uh, yellow stars. What I've been struggling right now with this character, I've been testing him on um, on the skill nodes. He does a good sack on the first node, which is not great. And uh, he does a good clear on the first node, which is not great either. Nice, 15 Miasma. So neither of those situations are like optimal, but it's enough to test him out. And what I really feel, even with Skirmisher Eyes Away, the guy has like Horrible focus. The focus is just so garbage. Okay, 500. That's great. That Peter B. Parker, he really, really struggles with the focus. Even with Skirmisher Eyes Await. Which is definitely not, uh, not great. Okay, let's see how we are doing here with this event. KVN, what's up? Welcome back. Uh, we are okay, sort of. Sort of. 
need I need to sleep more. And she is uh, tired of being on the hospital. It has been uh, too much. And they are saying that she might have to be there for one more week. And she's not uh, the kind of person that uh, is okay with sitting around doing nothing. So, yeah. Not great, not great. But not uh, too bad. Okay, we clear the thing. Let's collect this junk. War milestones, okay. We're gonna do these war attacks as fast as possible. Don't want to take too long. When Goblin Awaken abilities? Oh man, who knows? Who knows when these go Goblin Awaken abilities are going to show up? I guess they'll not show up until we have the next legendary character. Which, uh, which is going to be next month, right? So maybe after next month, we'll get uh, the Goblin abilities. But Scobo is really holding back. And now they said that uh, instead of three legendaries per year, it's going to be only two legendaries per year. How do you guys feel about that? We went from almost four legendaries in one year to possibly two legendaries in one year with a Dark Dimension in the middle. Is that enough or, uh, or would you guys like to see way more legendaries? Man. Sorry, I apologize. There is something flying. Something flying in the kitchen and I'm I'm not a big fan of things that fly. Can you send a video of uh, Apoc, Pegasus, No Castle beating Bifrost in CC? Oh no, that's a big waste. What Apocalypse versus versus Bifrost. That's a really waste. Uh, of your uh, of your apocalypse you are the worst raising nerd can you at least uh, attack me from the second <laughs> you guys are on the same arena shard on the gdm boa noite genebra boa noite espetáculo no crisol com a defesa Wow, so Ginebra, he won 48,000 versus 16,000. Wow, that's super crazy. So the defense really worked. Spiders can fly, please no. How to beat ST Taskmaster in room 5? ST Taskmaster should be easy. They have no health. Post pictures here. Of course you can. Of course you can, Master Gilgamesh. Also, let me share some... Uh, He slingshots you every day. Oh, yikes. CC Bart, what's up? I, I have no idea. I have no idea. My opponent faced that on room 5 and he was not able to clear. I don't know. I saw that uh, Porky Pad was crying a lot because of the, the results he got. Wow, what? Really? Is this for real? Damn, that's crazy. So, Master... <laughs> what the hell is this? Oh? Oh? <laughs> what? Is this what? From last season or this season? 
I need to ask my black quarter expert uh, VNM if this is for real or not. Woke up this morning and my son had uh, taken his diaper off. This. Oh yikes! Very interesting raising nerd, yeah. Tonado Max Japan, welcome back. Wow, this is kind of crazy. Are you sure your kid did this? <laughs> I, I have no idea. It, one million punch up? Like, this is ridiculous. I, I would like to see this replay. This, this sounds insane. Christoph, Christopher, what would you recommend against Cabal plus Robbie and Black Cat in room 6? I'm offense heavy, Apocalypse Scroll available. I mean, uh, uh, something fast and furious. Uh, take Apocalypse, Eternals, Emma Frost, should be easy win. Yeah, that's a absolutely easy win. Apocalypse, Eternals, Emma Frost. They cannot spawn with safeguard, and uh, and you should be able to to clear that Robbie race fast, and then uh, Falcon punch with uh, with Apocalypse. I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. I, I I can't say for sure. Can't say for sure. If it was on room three or. Or room for the one with more energy, maybe. But I mean, they have counters against hero cosmic, but not villain cosmic. But um, I don't know. I don't know. Is it possible? Who knows? I mean, if Thanos is if Thanos flips all those buffs. They spawn with a lot of buffs. They spawn with a lot of regens. If they flip all those buffs, I guess it's possible. Like, I guess it will be possible. Suzuki. <laughs> they don't have. Yeah, they don't have safeguard. They don't have safeguard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I understand how it works. Yeah. Thanos goes super fast, he flips, and uh, and it's game over for them. The only problem is Thanos surviving. If Thanos survives the counter attacks, I guess. I, I say it's possible. I say it's possible. I say it's possible. I have to face the Black Order. I have to face Bifrost today. So if for some reason I mess up, we can. I can try this for science. But we'll see. Okay, so let's go back in game. As I said, I have to do Alliance Wars. Man, this cable is getting really nasty. Yeah, it's like... Uh, it's like Shield. When people are using Shield, like Wakanda. Shield, Wakanda. Thanos goes, Thanos flips. And if they don't go fast enough, it's game over for them. So I'm not sure if it's possible or not, but I would say that it's very, very likely. Don't make me build Black Order. No, no, no. You can still use uh, that seed. Just don't do that like Dorky Dad and use I've Mind and then uh, don't use the, the abilities. Oh my God. Okay, so we are facing the black, we are stuck on the bridge. Why are we attacking two rooms? Who's attacking the second room? Cowers. Bro, do not attack the second room. Ben, but all these teams are super small, yikes. Okay, maybe let's destroy this. So, black order, quicksilver, what beats that? I have no idea. Then we have uh, this team over here. 
Then we have this team over here. Can can we beat this with the uh, with Omega Red? I guess we're gonna find out. Or maybe with Taskmaster. Oof, but this team can punch up so big on other rooms. Let me see again. So both rooms they have uh, that BS. Okay, let's try. Let's try. This is a uh, kind of a waste. Using under ah, I'm not gonna do this. Okay, I'm gonna skip that. So we're gonna try Omega Red. Underworld there feels no bueno. Okay, here we go. Weapon X versus Heroes for Hire with a Fire Starter. Man, but this Shang-Chi is so small. Like, bro. It feels so bad to use these teams. Let's see. Black Order is a niche. I'm not sure if it's a niche or if we didn't find a good way to use them. I think that's the the situation. Is that we didn't find a proper way to use them. So we cannot use them to their full potential. Okay, we're going to use a force versus Pegasus with the Cloak and Dagger. I have seen this team around quite a lot. And they shred. It works based on Cloak applying negative effects to everyone. This is great on the security room. On this room without the security, I'm not sure if that's if it is that good. But we're going to remove those offense subs. Okay, we're going to try to get some negative effects. So Jessica Jones gets speed up. Nice, she's blinded. I never remember why they get these blinds. But let's apply this rub to that girl over there. Wow. Captain Marvel, she almost got one-shotted. Which is not good. Let's blind these mofos over here. Double tap the dagger, maybe. Some e big healing. Wow, that was some massive healing from a Photon, I guess, from her passive. Okay, so far so good. Let's keep shipping that uh, rescue away. And this is pretty much game over already. This team really hard counters. The um, A Force really hard counters. Pegasus with Cloak and Dagger. Big ultimate. No vulnerabilities. Okay, we're gonna smash again. With the Spider Woman. And then Captain Marvel gets the last killing blow. Yay! Better than their movie. 100%. Demolorian, welcome back. DBA Kija or Kia, welcome back. It's not. How are you doing today, Malorian? Did you win? Did you lose? How is Crucible treating you treating you today? Okay, so far so good. Let's see. Okay, Black Order. And the um, I wonder if uh, Underworld can beat this team. Eh? So, Underworlds, they should go pretty fast. And, uh, and they have safeguard on the buffs. So, let's see. Okay, here we go. Underworld versus Black Order with Quicksilver and Deadpool. We're going to get a little bit creative over here. Yeah, Vietnam, yeah. It's, uh, it's a tough match. That you can meet with uh, Sinister Six or something. So the slowest character is it? Uh, okay, I'm gonna be able to block uh, the Quicksilver to apply trauma to him. Okay, blind on everyone. 
Okay. We should be able to delete the Thanos before he goes. Summon the minions. Get that safeguard going. Nice. She's still there, wow. Okay, let's go with the basic. I think it attacks multiple targets, right? 50% chance to attack adjacent characters. Man, this green goblin is so trash. Ultimate green goblin. Ultimate garbage, I would say. Okay, let's delete the Quicksilver. Did he dodge or did I got blinded? Okay, he's gone. He's gone, so it's game over. Thanos is blinded. He doesn't get enough speed bar to do anything. Gonna remove all his buffs. Leave Ebony Maw for uh, last. Okay, you gone. Special offense down, okay. He doesn't get the counter. That's interesting. Okay, let's do the ultimate with Kingpin. Clear those dead proofs away. Nice. Go away. Taskmaster with a stun, he has immunity, and now he can press auto and win. Okay, so far so good. PR Kevin, welcome back. No, we didn't do CC yet. We're gonna do a quick water, and then we'll do the CC. I think... Uh, I think you can beat... Uh, depends of the size and depends of the room, but I think you can beat Nowhere Scroller with... Uh, with Sinister Six, but really depends on the size. Valdor Mamu and what's his name? Didn't clear by Frost, but one because... Awesome, awesome. That's amazing. So, so far, like 10 to 1, the my defense working versus not working. The battery build, Val, and the leader. And the scroll. Doesn't Thanos doesn't even get empowered fast enough? Yes, yeah. Yeah, this is the power of the um, Black Alliance. Okay, Hero as Guardians. I don't really like this team. Usually use Wakanda here, but uh, I'm not sure if Wakanda is good enough. I guess I could use Wakanda versus. Heroes for Hire. Let's see what they have on the final room. Okay, so I think I can use Tangle Web. Some kind of hybrid Tangle Web here. Can I use Dead Seed, maybe? Yeah, let's, let's not try to be fancy about it. Weapon X, but Weapon X is better elsewhere. Zemo. Better not. Tangle Web. We're gonna save the Tangle Web for now. Mm. I don't want to use Wakanda because Wakanda strugg struggles a little bit versus this Gwenpool version. But maybe, maybe you should try. They don't have Sif. Okay, so if they don't have Sif, I guess it's okay. 119 Paris, welcome back. So Honor. What happened yesterday, So Honor? I saw that you got uh, timed out or banned from the Dorky Dead chat. What happened? LeBandit, thank you very much. Very, very appreciated. Let me see what were those things that were popping up. Zoe boy fresh with a follow and Tuka Tuka Shimoto Samurai also with a follow, but that was yesterday. Ijuninho with a follow as well. Thank you very much guys. Welcome to the chat. Too many windows open. Someone tried it early and it didn't work. Yeah, like I said, depends of the room, depends of the size of the team, depends who gets turny winded. My defense, you can see my defense on uh, this video, right here. I made a video with my defense, it's at the end of the video. You can see it right now. Uh, yeah, this one. Season 7 best events for everyone. 
And like I was saying, around 10 people already told me that uh, it's a very good defense. And this was this was my opponent defense. It was nice too. It was nice too. But he was not able to full clear mine, and I was able to full clear your his. He got banned for being a captain obvious and telling people how easily they could counter Dorky's defense. I mean, and he got triggered because of that. He was quote unquote TV crafting room three defense with uh, would be a good assister. I said run echo. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> okay, we're going to use Wakanda versus Hero as Guardians with uh, Gwen Pool. This can be problematic if they have Sif. If they don't have Sif, uh, it's not a big deal. Usually, usually. You can get some bad RNG and get screwed. So we'll see how it goes. The good thing about this team is that uh, Gwen Pool, she has Safeguard. So that means... The Black Panther is going to give a bunch of safeguards to us. Unless we push the Gwen pool too low. Or she gets that bug. You see that bug that's going on right now? She's dropping below health and healing up again. What What's up with this bug? There is no character that does this. What is this bug? Wh why is she healing so much? Like, bro, what is this? Why she keeps healing? It's so stupid. Uh, I guess I'm going to do the special. Not really a good idea to use the special now, but... Look at this shit. What's going on here? It's not the first time that this happened. It has happened multiple times that... Uh, she. It's not only she. I have seen this happening also against Better Ray Bill. So we have the safeguard, so it should be fine. Let's attack the better AB, I guess. Have you guys never seen that bug before? It happened to me already multiple times, and it's not only the, the girl, it's uh, it's all of them. So better AB, it can also happen the same thing. You see, he keeps healing. Why why he keeps healing? What is this shit? None of my characters have uh, exposed or anything like that. So why this keeps happening? Okay, I would like to turn you in the Vala, but you don't have the chance or the opportunity. Battery Bill keeps healing, because why not? Man, this game and its stupid bugs. Is she going to revive already? No, not yet. Okay. So we have one more turn to try to finish this guy. And the problem is that he's about to taunt. He's about to, to taunt, no, to ult him. Look at this! Why is he healing so much? This guy has no charges. That's great, too. Why he keeps healing, bro? Like, seriously. This is so stupid. It's really so stupid. And now he kills my team. What's up with this shit bug? What's up with this shit bug? Man, seriously, what is this shit? What is this shit? What is this shit bug, man? Seriously. Why are they healing? Why? Why are they healing? It's so stupid. But it happens to all of them. It's not only to better reveal. It's to better reveal, to Gwenpool. It's to all of them. It's so stupid. Really stupid bug, man. Okay, so let's try again. We're going to use Wakanda versus the Steam. And see if the, the stupid bug does not activate. Or uh, I put uh, now the Black Panther 1 million next to Nakia. So he gets the energy. And we can also spam Safeguard. And now they're... Okay, I'm not attacking the same team, I guess. Because they are not even in the same position. And last time, Black Panther went first. Now the other Black Panther goes first. Oh, look at this shit, man. They keep getting ill and ill and ill. Look at this. It's so stupid. 
It's really so stupid. Okay, heal blocker. At least that. So we have to spam heal blocker on these morphos. So I'm going to... And this one has Sifa. Yikes. This one has Sifa. So let's turn it on her. And you have to apply that heal blocker to... To better rebuild. Shuri Striker, guys. I keep saying Shuri Striker. Everyone laughing. Not gonna laugh when... Uh, when the Shuri Striker comes after you. Okay, ability block on better rebuild. See if we the taunt now. Not really sure why he yield. I guess because of the regions. So I can go basic. So if I go basic. Okay, Okoye is going next turn. So I should be able to turn rewind the Valor. Okay, let's turn rewind the Valor. And now you have to full nuke the Val, I guess. Otherwise, she's going to revive her. Basic. Yeah, this, I think this is going to go very poorly. Okay, here we go. Man, I'm getting destroyed and I don't, I don't even understand very well why. Who's really attacking me? Like, my characters take no turns. Okay, should you with the defense up? And now Val revives everyone. Fadas caralho, meu. Such a fucking shit team, man. So, it's full of bugs. Like, this shit. It's full of bugs. Really. Really unbelievable. It, it works fine. The problem is when they start healing up like crazy. It works fine. The problem is when they start healing up like crazy like that. I don't know if it's the safeguard or something, or immunity plus safeguard plus whatever, but it's just stupid. They keep healing over and over again. They become unkillable. It's it's such a stupid bug. And no, no one has talked about this. It, what I find amazing, it's it's like no one is paying attention or, or I don't know. Okay, I can try with this shit team, but... Um, let's see. Fucking hell, man. So fucking stupid. Why I'm losing two attacks because of some shit bug. <sighs> well, thankfully, the, the Star Lord survived because, of course, of course, the, the bots do perfect chain attack. Of course, the bots have to do perfect chain attack because why would not uh, do something else? Okay, Doctor Doom got pushed. Oh, and I have the wrong guys to wait on Doctor Doom. Oh, that's that's lovely. Please land a disrupt. One disrupt, please. Great. Another one there. Cool. Uh, let's smash this Val in the face. Of course, no crit. Why would this guy crit? Usually the, the passive of uh, Kang does not trigger the, the passive of that girl, but I guess not today. And now they have safeguard, so I cannot remove the dead proofs. Lovely. Battery will kill. What? What's the size of this battery build? What's the size of this? Seriously, man, what's the size of this guy? 10 diamonds? For the scar Almeo. Three times. Oh my fucking god, what is this? Really unbelievable. 10 diamonds on, on battery bill or what? Like I'm fuck these. Like I'm done with R for today. For the scar Almeo. Seriously. What the fuck is this shit? 10 diamonds on this guy? 800 k power, okay. I mean, it's not that big. For the scar, Almeo. Really amazing. Really amazing. Just suck it. There, there is no reason to suck. I'm using normal counters. It, it, it works every day, except today. Scar, Almeo. Okay, moving on from... Uh, Shit fucking war. The only war that actually matters is the one that uh, everything goes wrong. It's really amazing. 
Really fucking amazing. Uh, yeah, maybe Black Order there, yeah. Maybe I should use Black Order there. Really unbelievable. Really unbelievable, seriously. And I don't understand why the... The War Dogs were not working properly, like... Was not... Was Naki not giving enough energy? Or was it because I didn't do the special with the uh, with Shuri? I guess I didn't use the special of Shuri on the second match, and they didn't got enough energy and charges. The problem is that the 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 Nakia she ran out of charges. Ay, okay. We're gonna do the crucible now. Now that I'm stressed, now we can do the crucible. Let's just do one attack here to don't waste energy. And hopefully the the crucible will not be bugged because of water. Okay, so we are facing Mr. Kennedy, of course we are. And the Kennedy's from uh, Doom at Summit. And his defense, let's see. So Extreme, Rogue Room 1. By Frost Room 2 with a big uh, Sylvie. Infinity Watch on 3. Scroll with the uh, Hive Mind on 4. Out of Time with Quicksilver on 5. And Dormammu SD on uh, 6. So I'm not really sure what to use here, but we'll see. Okay, so today we are back for second round of Crucible Season 7, first week. And of course, we are facing Mr. Kennedy. Kennedy. And Mr. Kennedy is coming from uh, the Duma Summit Alliance. He's sitting at uh, 88 million TCPNAS. So we are just punching up uh, 10 million. And he has been level 100 for like uh, one month, so good for him. I'm sure his teams are big as hell. So on defense he has... Unlimited or Extreme, Extreme with Rogue. Not the biggest Rogue ever, but uh, all the other characters are quite big. By Frost on uh, Room 2, Infinity Watch on 3. Big Infinity Watch, probably a few characters level 100. I've mined with scroll on 4, this is very very dangerous if you don't have your Cabal on offense. Then uh, out of time with Quicksilver and Red Hulk, another problematic team. And finally Dormammu with uh, Noir and uh, Secret Defenders. So a lot of problematic teams, let's see how we're going to do about this, but it's not going to be easy. My CC yesterday, I, I crushed my opponent. He was not able to clear uh, two rooms. So let's see. I'm gonna start off with what? I'm gonna start off with Infinity Watch. I don't have Wakanda Saver on the Crucible part. Okay. Does it need any special position in Crucible? I don't think so. I think the position in Crucible doesn't matter, right? Just knock in the middle to stop the, the chain attacks. Okay, so we're going to start off with uh, Room 3, where uh, characters with offense up assist. And we're going to use Infinity Watch versus Wakanda, or Wakanda versus Infinity Watch. Striker has a weight on Shuri because she is MVP. So here we go. Let's see how it goes. We are punching up 400k. The team we are facing is probably level 100. And mine is level 97, I think. I'm not sure. So it's definitely not going to be a free win. So we're going to attack Moondragon. And we already saw that she's level 100. And now we are going to copy that speed up. 
Yes, let's copy that speed up. We are also going to yes, spread the offense subs. So you're going to get assists with everyone. This should be interesting, right? This should be interesting. So let's turn rewind everyone with Okoye. This is becoming even more interesting. I'm not sure if putting Infinity Watch on this room is a good idea. But that's how, what uh, our opponent is doing. So more offense ups, more assists. Bashenga going through with that uh, piercing damage. Nakia as well. And even Shuri. Shuri that striker off offense up. Or... Yeah, okay. So here we go. Striker Shuri. We have to go through two death proofs. We got one, we got two, and there we go, Striker Shuri getting the killing. Very nice, very, very nice. Okay, so Nakia, let's go after Filavel, I guess. We still have to do a, a remove revive on one of those girls over there. Can you destroy them so they don't get to that proof? No, we can't. No, we can't. Okay, so far so good. No one has offense up. Like, why would you put uh, Infinity Watch here if they don't have offense subs? Okay, here we go now with uh, the special of Bashinga to destroy that file of value. And it seems like we are going to destroy a Nebula at the same time. Ooh, but that's a big problem. Wow. We lost uh, Okoye. That's a big, big problem. Okay, let's go after Nebula then. We have to delete her. And delete it after reviving. So, oh, now we have the. Oh, let's see. Defense down, that's good. We need to get a kill. Nice, you got a kill. Black Panther loves this room. Okay, we have one offense up. We still have some assists. Let's go. We need to get another kill with Black Panther. So it works. Nice. There we go. Let's get that offense up now and another kill. Nice. We get 10 turns back to back. Maybe I should go after Adam Warlock, but I want to slow that uh, Gamora. Let's see. Oh, if Bashing attacked early, we could get a defense down, but not like this. Okay, so here we go. Striker has a way to Shuri. Let's go. Another kill. Yes. And Naki goes now. Nice. Another one. One more attack, and it's over. Okay. Not the best RNG, but we did it. We did it, guys! We did it! What kind of destroyed Infinity Watch in room 3? What's a surprise? Nakia to the moon, indeed. Not the best efficiency, but uh, clean kill. Okay. We back. So, extreme with Rogue. I could use that team I used yesterday with Tangle Web. Because once again, it seems like I'm not going to be able to use Tangle Web anywhere. So, let's try that. We will use this team yesterday and it was very, very good. So, here we go. Tangle Web with the Lizard. Oh, I, I could save the Lizard for later. For the Black Cat. Man. Okay, we're gonna go like this. We're gonna go like this and then we'll see. Okay, so we're gonna use Tangle, Tangle Web with a Sinister Six versus Extreme x Men. We are still punching up uh, 350k, but I think it will be fine because my Sinister Six, they are big as hell. I finally got three diamonds on Craven, so. If Craven was doing crazy things yesterday, today should be even better. So we're gonna apply slow to those mofos over there. I think I'm gonna slow rogue. Or not. No, let's remove those offense ups. Okay. Now we're gonna apply vulnerability to 2099. Let's go, get that speed bar going. 
And uh, we're gonna stun her. They have offense up. Wow, that's that's great. Okay, let's get that offense up. Give that offense up to Craven. Okay, now you're gonna attack. Uh, Spider Weaver still didn't talk a turn. That's gonna be a problem for me. Because the, the other guy is going to the, the other girl is going to taunt. Her. And 2099 died before Weaver took a turn. What the hell? What happened here? Okay, let's go. We have those charges from Weaver now. I have no idea what happened, to be honest. And now they have all those evades. Let's clear those away. And let's see if Weaver survives long enough. She's not getting any speed barrier, okay? Let's heal up. Striker is await. Please do some big damage. Gambit is about to take another turn. Bro, like, what's going on here today? What happened? What? Is this the, the rooms from last season, or what season is this? What? How is it possible that Spider Weaver didn't take a single turn? She took so many turns, like... I, I really don't know how to think. What's, what's going on with the game today? We did this match yesterday with Dormammu. It was more difficult with Dormammu. We did this with Dormammu. Exactly the same shit yesterday. The team was even bigger. It was almost 3.2 million power. Extreme split. But, but it doesn't make sense that Spider Weaver didn't take a single turn. It didn't make sense that Spider Weaver didn't take a single turn before, uh, before they went. Father's <sighs> car, I'm Today is really not a good day. Okay, so what? Black Order here. We already saw that Black Order works here, so we're gonna use Black Order here, right? Jesus Christ, seriously. Hive Mind. Oh man, can I use Hive Mind here? I'm not sure if I'm stupid enough to use Hive Mind here. Dead Seed or No Balls? Okay, we're gonna try Dead Seed or No Balls. Here we go. I don't remember very well this match, but since we already lost that first room, we can go for the for science. Comp case, welcome back. Thank you very much. Very, very appreciated. Oh, this guy has a good position on the team. Let's see. Got ability block, great. Uh, now what? Uh, the special, right? I don't remember if it's the special or the the ultimate. Okay. Loki's going first for reasons. Of course, they have to attack uh, that guy over there. Uh, they already have speed up. Uh, and they have immunity. So... I guess I'm going to attack them. Or just attack uh, Valor. I should try to heal up Dark Beast. But... Um, man, he dies, he dies with the bleeds. Oh my god, really? Really? Really, really, really? And now I cannot attack her. I have to attack her in, anyway. It's not like I have a chance. And she barely got on the yellow, man. Fucking hell, so unlucky today, really. What's up with this shit? So fucking unlucky. Okay, and now I lose. So fucking unlucky, it's really unbelievable. Okay, let's get all those buffs. 
Now I have no Dark Beast, so he doesn't die because there is no assist. And there we go. I've mind destroys by Frost. Yes, I know. I know. Unless you are Darky Dead, by Frost uh, gets. Yeah. Let's try the Black Order. Oh, it's too small. Oof. I thought my Black Order was bigger. This is too much. Oh. Uh, yeah, this is too much. If, it, if they were like 1.6, I would try it. But 1.2 is very, very low. Okay, we're gonna do the, the easy mode then. Easy mode, supposedly. Supposedly. You can get unlucky. So, I've mined versus... By Frost. 500k punch up. They can punch up 1 million. As long as you use the, the Red Goblin ultimate. Let's see. Yeah, those bleeds, they really roasted me. So you can use the special or the ultimate. The problem with either abilities is that... Uh, they... I'm going to use the, the ultimate. Put them all together. Okay, we got the ability block on everyone except... Uh, Got ability block on everyone except on Val. We're gonna apply this route to better ability. Okay. Now we're gonna attack the characters with uh, vulnerability. Here we go. We need to clear those bleeds away. Val got destroyed. Tons of counter attacks, but we are fine for now. Now we're gonna use the ultimate of. Uh, Red Goblin, and you want to attack the character with the most buffs. If you want to do the most damage, you attack the character with the most buffs. And Red Goblin is almost dying. Oh, no, they are almost dying. Okay, let's use the special for no reason. Val is stunned for days. Uh, use the basic, no reason to use the others. Basic much better. I don't understand why so many people, why are using the ultimate? Juicy, Dorky Dead, why are you guys using the ultimate? The basic gives speed bar to Venom, and you are also removing the evades and the death proofs. Like, it makes no sense why you guys use the ultimate. If they have evades, what kind of negative effects are you trying to spread? Okay, you get the speed bar out, delete the, the Val, get some energy, stun. The character with the, the stun. And once again, use the basic, not the, the ultimate. They have evades. Use the basic that is undodgeable. Very easy. Easiest counter ever. So if you don't have your Bifrost big enough, use that. Okay, so now what what can I use on room? Uh, so I have to use uh, full. Uh, I have to use full cabal here. Today I cannot split cabal. Today it has to be full cabal. And uh, what can we do? Unstable energy. I still need to go first. Still need to go first. Uh, I still need to go first. So now at least they have safeguard. Now at least they have safeguard. How am I going first and stop that? Uh, I guess I can stop him. They have two euros. If they have two euros, 
So if I use... Oh, am I going to sacrifice Vulture for this? Sacrifice Vulture for this. It might be the case. Vulture and Emma Frost. That should allow me to turn you on the Emma. That should allow me to turn you on the Emma. And... Um, I'm not sure if it's going to work. So... So you're going to use Kabbala with Vulture and Emma Frost. The goal is to... Make sure that Vulture gets 20% speed barrier from uh, the hero enemies. And then Emma Frost to reduce the speed barrier of them. Not to the speed bar, the speed bias. And uh, hopefully the turning wine from Vulture will be enough uh, to allow Neymar to go first and turning wine them. We'll see. This is for science for sure. Still on the week one, uh, punching up 600k. So many reasons why this might fail. Definitely many reasons. The Void Knight is still going to get a speed bar. Uh, supposedly. But yes, like I thought, uh, Vulture will go first and turning wine them. Great. Now we have this Mofo with this Stun. Uh, yeah, I guess we're going to use the Stun on Void Knight. Nice. Scroll is already on his knees. Okay, now I'm going to do a big turn in wine to all of them. Let's go. Nice, someone already died. I didn't notice who. Oh, it was Gwenpool. Great. And now we can. Now we can what? Let's use the ultimate of this Mofo. People say that the ultimate of uh, the leader is trash. Let's see if that's the case. Okay, here we go. Big ultimate from the leader offense up. Tons of barrier, okay. Wow, uh, yeah. He deleted three. And uh, scroll is on his knees already. Vulture with another ultimate, because why not? Why to do one ultimate when you can do two? And Emma Frost with the mind control. Gets that scroll out of the way. Easy. Cool. Weaver, Apocalypse, Emma Frost, Cable. Nova. Okay, I'll try that one uh, tomorrow if I remember. But if you want to send a screenshot, for sure. Yeah, Cabal, uh, especially on that room, if they go first, uh, they really destroy it. Okay, so I'm going to have some problems versus all of these teams. It's great. Uh, I guess I can use the, the Lizard now here, since I already broke the other team. So we're going to use Lizard in the corner, or let's do it the other way around. So we're going to use these Mofos. Is this room 6? This is room 6. Yikes. So, Lizard. Let's put Deadpool in the middle. It's, it's probably going to lose, but uh, but yeah. Save the Apocalypse for the next room. Yeah, I, I have to... I think I have to... New Warriors this one. Uh, maybe I should level up my New Warriors a little bit. So, let's save this team. And level them up a little bit. At least the characters that matter. So, Lizard. What level you are, Lizard? 97. 99. At least 99. So, we need Lizard. We need Gwenpool. Firestar. Deadpool. And not Cloak. Not because I'm racist, but because he's kit based, not uh, not anything else. Where is Deadpool? Okay, there she is. Yesterday we lost this match because the, the gap between level 97 and 100 is too high. It's too big. And Firestar, what level you are at? 98? Okay, 99. Let's see if it's enough. 
We are under 20 million gold, yikes. Thankfully, the next character is not coming anytime soon. And I have all these orbs to open, but I can't. How am I going to open these orbs? One by one? Impossible! Okay, here we go. Let's see. Still a big punch up. The real invader, what's up? Welcome back. Let's see what's that on the... Okay, okay, I see, yeah. I mean, you are still using Apocalypse, but I guess it's a good counter. Did they talk any turns or how it was? Nova there for the stun, very important for sure. And it was not a 3 Diamonds Apocalypse, because right now that 3 Diamonds Apocalypse, it just deletes everything. 99 to 100 is still huge, yeah. Yeah, but that's all I can afford for now. Okay, so we're going to use uh, the, these new warriors with Lizard. See if we can get lucky. You feel lucky, punk? Not really. So, yeah, we're going to find out. Here we go. Big punch up. If you are lucky, Gwenpool will uh, kill them through the revives. And Lizard counters Dormammu, sort of. Not really. Okay. Let's apply vulnerability to Black Cat. Let's see. Get those dead proofs out. Great. Let's apply vulnerability to this girl over here. Disrupt on our mama, that's great. Now let's turn in all these mofos. Take damage, but not like enough damage to, to die. Just enough damage so wind pull kills you after. Let's turn in wind the Dormammu. Striker has a wait for a double tap. 2024, guys, please. Stop using your cloak as a skirmisher. Here we go, Quinn Pool, big ultimate. What? Oh my god, how is this possible? How is this possible? Are you telling me that Black Hat with no health? Black Hat with no health? Black Hat with no health? She actually was not. Uh... Nah, bro, like, does Gwenpool does not remove the, the death proofs or what happened? What is this shit, man? Seriously. Doesn't Gwenpool remove the death proofs or uh, am I stupid? And this bitch is ability blocker. Oh, I love this. Like, this game, this game today is really pissing me off. This game today, man, seriously. Fuck this shit, man. Okay, let's flip these buffs, I guess. I guess I'm stupid, like... When she kills characters that... Uh, and they cannot be revived, unless... Uh, unless she doesn't clear the death proofs. Scaranio. So, Gwenpool, she doesn't remove the revives, or they got resisted, or they had some secret safeguard that I didn't see. It's... it's... No, so, so she doesn't clear the death proofs, that's amazing. No, she doesn't clear the death proofs. Oh, I can, uh, I'm in the wrong window. She doesn't clear the death proofs. I thought she cleared the death proofs because, I mean, if a character kills you and you cannot revive, uh, that's the minimum you can expect. That's the minimum you can expect, but I guess not. I expected too much. So, Gwenpool, ultimate. So, uh, what am I supposed to do? The... the I guess I, I do basic. I guess I do basic and then I do the special. 
But she's not gonna have speed butter. She's she, she's skirmisher already. She's already skirmisher. But the problem is that the skirmisher it clears the dead proofs after after she takes the damage. So I, I don't know. And and the ability block uh, death pool. The cherry on top of the cake is is that the ability block uh, death pool. Okay, let's try again. So new warriors with lizard versus. Secret Defenders with Ormamu and uh, Nuara. Let's see if this time we can uh, remove those dead proofs. I guess it's Cloak Fault because Cloak didn't apply the Disruptor. That's another fail. Cloak not able to apply the Disruptor. Okay, so we got the vulnerability there. We flip the Dormammu. So it's all, it's all RNG, if Cloak applies the Disrupt or not. So I guess now I shouldn't attack them anymore. If I attack them, I have no chance of applying the Disrupt. Okay, so we are going to do basic here, I guess. Okay, cloak with the disruptor. Let's turn wind the Robbie Rays. Okay, we got the disrupt this time. No ability block on Gwen Pulse, she has immunity, great. And now please, bro, like seriously, delete the black hat. Yay, it worked finally. Finally, something working. Okay, we need to apply ability block to Lizard. Or to Dormammu, sorry. No, he goes. Okay, we're gonna still apply... Uh, let's just use the basic here. Wow, this Dormammu is thick. He's a thick boy. Okay, let's go after Robbie Reyes. Please delete the Dormammu, great. Turning wind are lighter. Special. Basic. Evade, because why not? Now she's going to heal, him, heal them up for a lot. No vulnerability there. For reasons. Let's go with the basic for drain. Nice. And now let's turn wind this small photo oblivion. Another special with Gwen Pula. Protect the lizard. Oof! He still takes it in the face. More evades. And there we go. Nice. Okay, cool. So I guess on the first match I just did too much damage to Black Hat. And I didn't have that opportunity to apply the the disrupt with Cloak. Okay, so many fails so far. How many fails so far? One, two, three fails so far. Great. Extreme pull outs. Pull outs. So I'm going to save Masters of Evil for that place. I still have a Craven. Uh, what does Craven stops? Noir for the Shadow Realm, yeah, absolutely. Okay, it's getting better, it's getting better. Two rooms left. Craven. Does Craven stop like a... I have also Mysterio, but now I already use the Lizard, so... Flip all dead proofs, okay, not good. I think I'm gonna suck it. I think I just have to suck it. Take the L.
Okay, we're gonna take that L. We're gonna sack it. We're gonna use Masters of Evil with Apocalypse on the other room. Let's use Undying here. Also, have Tangle Web. But we're gonna save Tangle Web to clear up after. So we can sack. Um... Let's do a good sack. So you're gonna use this. We're gonna use Doctor Doom with Skirmisher, and we're gonna use Phoenix. Phoenix, where are you at? Where is my Phoenix, bro? Seriously. Cyclops. Oh, there she is. Okay, so the position for this, we want this guy, we want this guy, we want this girl, we want this guy and this guy. Okay, there we go. And uh, oh, there is that chance, that is, there is that one chance in a billion. Okay, fortify level one. We're gonna use Phoenix Fortify level one. And we're gonna keep this guy as a skirmisher. But as a fortifier. Just in case. Because if he's a striker, I don't think he can survive. Mass of Evil plus Cabal in room two versus Rogue Extreme. I don't know, man, like some people have been saying that they beat very easily Extreme Rogue with Cabal, uh, with Cabal, no, with, uh, with Pegasus, and I've minded. I have not seen it myself, but this is what people are saying. I was just thinking, well, we have Apocalypse Castro, Iron Man, here, and it worked. And then I have to use Full Masters of Evil on Room 1. Then we'll have Apocalypse Castro and Iron Man here. Uh, I mean, is your apocalypse three diamonds or just two diamonds? Yeah, because that, the spider weaver has that uh, that counter thing, right? So tangle web with apocalypse, Castro and Iron Man. Supposedly, my Iron Man is very big. Supposedly. Any special position or anything goes? 2.8, yikes. Three diamonds apocalypse. Yeah, I mean, but if you have to, to if you can one shot it, like, what else can you do? And then Masters of Evil on the other room. Masters of Evil on the other room. Well, I was really counting on Apocalypse versus... No, I, I I believe this works. I really believe this works. But I, I want to make sure that... Uh, I want to make sure that I can clear that room one. I want to make sure that I clear that room one and I think I need Apocalypse for that. I could also use Doctor Doom on room one. But I'm afraid. Okay, we're going to go like this. So here we go. We're going to try to cheese room 4 or 5. Flashbang. This is actually room 5. So this is the room where the ultimates apply blind. Interesting. Let's see how it goes. We are facing a big Black Knight. Big Quicksilver. Big Red Hulk. Big everything. But Phoenix is she's very interesting to counter this room. And also with uh, Undying. Okay, so there we go. They attack Phoenix. Offense down and Doctor Doom goes. Great. Let's see if you can remove that taunt. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That guy got destroyed right away. Crazy stuff. Okay, Zombie Jugger now with the taunt. Mm, I'm going to use the basic... Yes, he'll block us. So I'm going to use the basic just to spread those bleeds. Maybe he'll die. 
Marta bleeds. Marta bleeds. Let's go. He still has some more dead proofs. And now he's gone. Okay. Phoenix dies. Cool, cool. Red Hulk is already dead. Kill the Gregs. Great. So now we are going to special over here. Phoenix should die as well. Oh, Red Hulk is still alive. He's still alive, but he's on stealth. Okay, so here we go. We're going to use uh, the Hella ultimate with no charges on everyone. It seems like uh, Red Hulk died now, I guess. I hope. Zombie Iron Man now with the, the ability block. Please don't clear those negative effects away. Somehow... Somehow these mofos are still alive. And I guess I'm going to stop the match before... Uh, she revives the, the other guy. Wow, if only that ability block had landed properly. Okay, so now I'm going to time out because I don't want the other guys to revive. And uh, so far, so good, right? So far, so good. I don't think I can push this any further. Let's see. Can we remove that taunt? No, more taunts. Yeah, okay. So he's going to use his ultimate, right? Let's let him lose the ultimate. Nope. Okay, no ultimate. So let's just time out. What's with Pegasus in uh, room 2? Buy Frost on defense. Uh, try to mirror match. I don't know. I have not seen a lot of uh, Pegasus counters. Castrol Raider and he got lucky. There is a mosquito over there. Summer in Hungary, it's mosquitoes everywhere. She can't revive Black Knight outside of uh, water. Ah, uh, yeah, but I don't think it will go anywhere. I mean, can it get any worse? Too? Okay, she used the special. Yeah, they didn't revive anyone. But um, I cannot get through those immunities and so on. And every time I push her, they are going to to taunt. Yeah, game over. Okay, there you go. Game over. But I mean, it was fine. We cleared the Black Knight. We cleared the the Red Hulk. So the cleanup is going to be a lot easier. Three characters instead of five. And Not yet. Okay. So we're going to use uh, Masters of Evil with uh, Apocalypse 2.6 million only. Yikes. 2.6 scares me a little bit. We're going to use uh, Absorbing Mana, uh, Titania. I wonder if I should use Castle here. Just to make sure that uh, she pings those defense downs away. Or even Quicksilver to turn the wine these mofos to Oblivion. Uh, I guess... Let's go with the Kestrel. Uh, she doesn't have a Hero Cosmic. Um, okay, so let's go with Quicksilver. The Hero Cosmic here would be nice. So let's see. So we're going to use Masters of Evil with Quicksilver and Apocalypse versus Extreme X-Men Room 1. If they attack us, they're going to get uh, Ability Block. If they have Raiders, they don't. 
If they have strikers, they're gonna kick our ass. So let's see how it goes. So Ken goes first to apply slow to not a Nightcrawler. Otherwise, Nightcrawler is gonna flip it to speed up. Okay, we have Disruptor on Rogue. Good, good, good. Now we have uh, what? Turnywine Stun. Turnywine Stun the Nightcrawler. Okay, here we go. Game it goes. Okay, that's not what I wanted. But Kang now gets a bunch of uh, speed body. I'm gonna use the basic of Kang. If you use the ultimate here, Forrest is gonna get a bunch of speed body. And then you die. So I think it's better to use the basic here. Quicksilver now. Uh, let's just uh, delete the Forge. Great. Uh, we can turn you on the Rogue. We can also remove the charges of uh, this guy. I don't know what the charges do on him, to be honest. But let's do that. So let's remove the charges. Disrupt. Okay, nice. Now you're going to apply Trauma to all of them and stun to Gambit. There we go. So Nightcrawler cannot do anything funny. Apocalypse is going to Falcon Punch that Nightcrawler out of existence. Nice. Titanium now. Can you smash that uh, guy in the face? Ooh, almost. Okay, not rush. Okay, we have a stunner. Let's do the stunner on Rogue. Turn you on the Gambit. Special with Apocalypse. He dodges somehow. Still got the ability blocker. And uh, now we have a Kanga with a, a bang. With a bang from his basic. 3 million, wow. 3 million with a, a 2.6 million attack uh, secondary. Pretty decent, pretty decent. I mean, Nina, welcome back. How are you doing today? Raider on Rogue, Forge Gambit and Nightcrawler. It, it, won't, it won't really matter. It won't really matter, as you saw. Can you do this without Apocalypse? Maybe, maybe. Maybe with Ultron you can do it. Okay, so we have these two, we have this, we have that. And we also have a big fat Thor. But you're going to use Red Hulk instead. Or not. We're going to use... Oh uh, yeah, let's use the Red Hulk, why not? Let's put the castle there. We still don't have Cosmic Heroes. Is there any reason to not use Eternals? No, let's go like this. One character that's... Oh, let's... No, let's take Nova. Nova is the option here. Let's make Nova Skirmisher. And... Uh, okay, here we go. So you're going to clean up uh, room uh, 5 uh, with uh, Tangle Web. Uh, Pegasus, Nowhere, all of the above. We only have one Quicksilver left. Phoenix did all the work uh, in the previous match together with Zombie Juggernaut. So we're gonna shred these Mofos. We're gonna apply slow. That's gonna speed up the Quicksilver, which is not optimal. But we're gonna stun. And supposedly, he shouldn't have like a lot of cooldowns. Okay, that was the special. Uh, let's use the basic here. Remove that offense up. Let's apply defense down to Quicksilver. Striker is away too. And then we have uh, Iron Man with his basic. Look at the damage of this dude. <laughs> 500 DK because he got blocked. There we go. So we full clear versus Mr. Kennedy. Unfortunately, some of the matches didn't work uh, very well. Uh, but I have a solid defense, or at least I hope. So hopefully he also failed a few attacks. And let's see if we have a final result. So 48,564, not great. Room 1 with double tap. The Vulture 
and Tango Web didn't work very well this time. Then we had Hive Mind versus Bifrost, which obliterated Bifrost. Then we had Wakanda versus Infinity Watch on Room 3, also obliterated. Cabal with uh, Vulture and Emma Frost on Room 4, very powerful. Also obliterated Hive Mind Scroll. Room number 5, double tap with Undying and uh, Scraps. And room number 6, New Warriors with Lizard. First time it didn't work out, but on the second time it was great. So let's see if we have a final result or not. Probably not. So yeah, it seems like Mr. Kennedy, he was online but he didn't attack. So we're going to wait and see. Maybe he's watching the stream to take notes. So there you go, we'll see the result tomorrow. For room 6 buffs, what do you think about putting Ghost Rider as Rider? Like, the crit chance doesn't do anything. The crit chance that you get, the 20% crit chance, it's not uh, good. Like, you are better off getting more... Uh, so, Ghost Rider, he, need, he applies bleeds. He vives out of bleeds. So, you are better off having characters as strikers. So, you apply more bleeds with isolate attack. Than, uh, than having the characters as Raider. And the Striker also increases the base damage, which is the damage that you get from the bleeds. I, I Like, the Raider there is just to bait you to spend our, your eyes away. Like, once again, I have said this many times. Raider, Skirmisher, blah, blah, blah. It's a bait to spend your eyes away. This one, uh, the last one. Also, crit chance. It's a bait. It's just a bait to spend your eyes away. It's nothing else. You should not switch your uh, your eyes away for this. Unless it's a very particular situation like, uh, for example, Photon. If you want to put Photon on defense, that's fine because she attacks multiple targets and you need the vulnerabilities. But I would still not recommend it. Gamma Apocalypse Room 3. Gamma Apocalypse on Room 3, interesting. Uh, not sure. Uh, I mean, if you have Superior 6 on defense, they destroy Gamma Apocalypse. If you have full Superior 6. Or be, not full Superior 6. You need the Craven, you need Mysterio. You need Green Goblin. Yeah, if you have those three, you should be fine. Plus other two, of course. Will you pair up with Cabal? Is it worth picking a Villa Controller Protector? No, it's not important. It's not important at all. You can use them together. You can use them separated. Yesterday, I used all of them separated. Today, I used all of them together. Sometimes you want to use... Most of the times, you want to use Emma Frost together with Emma. And then uh, you can use uh, Archangel Magneto or uh, Omega Red or Doctor Doom and Star-Lord. Uh, I don't know, you can pretty much use anything there. But once again, remember that you can use them separated. You only want to use them together if you are facing like Hive Mind Scroll. If it's not the case, if your opponent doesn't even have Scroll on defense, you can separate them to, for better results. Zemo, Red Skull, Taskmaster, King Pin in room 3. But, but they don't have offense upon spawn. On room 3, you need characters that have or offense up on spawn, or that can get offense up early on. That's why Wakanda here is very good. Dormammu is very good on room 3. So be careful with that. Yeah, I mean, everything is, is fine. Andre Argenta, I found Pegasus Room 2. Any advices? Not yet, not yet. Ted Bocot, welcome back. Check my message on Discord. Okay, I'll check in a second. Okay, let's try to do some war attacks. Man, I'm very unlucky today with war. Let's see. Really failing those three attacks in war. It's really disappointing. Taskmaster Quick. 
It's not quick, man. They have 120 speed. They don't have the, the water buffs. So they are super slow there. Okay, scroller. Scroller with the... Uh, with those mofos. Okay, scroll versus... Scroll extreme versus undying. Here we go. Let's see how it goes. This match should be harder than the... The... Hero as Guardians. Invaders, big trap. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's not a trap, like... Invaders at this point is not a trap, it's it's literally suicide. There is absolutely no reason to, to get up Invaders at this point. He's just burning your resources. Okay, so we're gonna do what? Ability block on... Uh, on Forge? Okay, yes. Yes? I need Disrupt. How am I going to apply Disrupt on Rogue? Okay, let's see. Let's flip all those buffs. Ability block on Forge. Oh, Rogue she Oh, nice. Great. So the Super Scroll already applied the Disrupt to Rogue. So that makes the match 10 million times more easy. Okay, Iron Man dies. Now we're going to spam that Scroller. Venom, please. Ultimate. Let's go. Please for everyone. Kala still didn't take a turn. Zombie Juggernaut is fully charged. Great. Okay, here goes the Hella. Spread those bleeds. Scroll now attacking Nightcrawler. Great. Zombie Juggernaut now is going to spread those bleeds. To the scroll. Ooh, scroll heal up. Ooh, that's not good. And we have uh, this rot on Hela. So I'm going to lose. I got so close and I'm going to lose. Okay, let's apply defense down to, to the scroll. I think a zombie juggernaut can solo it. Wow, Hela survived. Is he a raider or a striker? Is he a... Oh, he's a striker. Wow, GG. Okay. Then Striker is not able to kill Heller. Oh, but... <laughs> he can't, but uh, Gambit can. Okay, that's fine. Let's just fill these... Scroll with the bleeds. Up his ass. Uh, and now Zombie Juggernaut uh, with his special again. Let's go. Okay, easy. Very, very easy. Can Extreme beat uh, new warriors in water? Extreme can beat almost anything in water. Extreme are very, very strong in water. But with Rogue or without Rogue? With Rogue, it would be a problem. What about Superior 6 with Dr. Octopus in room 4? Yeah, I used that team yesterday. It's a good bait for the enemy's Superior 6. So, yeah. It's not like... Um, it helps you to the extent that your enemy is forced to use his own team because of the other rooms. Had the worst Crucible start didn't clear yesterday, and today went three losses. Uh, don't stress it out. It's still the the new season, right? So maybe maybe people will f up as well. Like myself, I'm effing up quite a lot. So don't stress out yet. It's too early for that. Okay, let's use uh, Wakanda here. Supposedly it's easy. I see. So we're going to use Wakanda versus Heroes for Hire. I'm not a big fan of these. But at this point, I need easy matches after effing up so much. Can X3? Yes, I think so. What counters I have mine in room 2? Bifrost, Pegasus, most of the teams beat that. Ooh. Ooh, that was that was the, the worst chain attack ever. Ooh, I guess it's over already. 
Oh, she really focused on on the middle. Yikes. That was a big, big yikes. Man, I hate Wakanda. Wakanda is such a shit team. There's never a time where Wakanda is like helpful for me. Okay, let's get our defense up. Immunity. We don't have safeguard because I'm stupid. And Shang-Chi kills the entire team. This is... This is a what? A, a Gear T16 Shang-Chi level 100. Fuck this guy, man. Gear T16 but level 100. Fuck this guy, man. Who the fuck has gold to put on Heroes for Hire at Gear T16? For the scare, I don't know. Really having a shit in war. Without Rogue? New Warriors without Rogue. I would not try it. Because it can happen like it happened to me now. If they focus very hard in the middle. And you don't have the Rogue to taunt after. Probably your entire team dies right away. Scaranio. This is my worst war ever. Okay, what can I use here? Tango Web. Can remove the yo yo. We have one stun for the Quicksilver. I should try to have another stun. Frost and Silver Surfer. Silver Surfer, Skirmisher. It could be Striker here. Okay, we're gonna go like this. Tango Web versus Black Order, Deadpool, uh, whatever. I think I'm gonna die right away. I think the Deadpool alone is gonna kill my team. She does way too much damage. What do you think? Uh, is the most impactful room in CC this season. All of them. All of them can be impactful. Wow. Wow. Bro. bro. Stop. Stop. How oh, are these characters, bro? Like, seriously. Does these people have, like, infinite mana or what? Really, I, I feel like I'm a, a poor ass bitch. These people just have infinite money to use anywhere. Okay. Spider Weaver, please take a turn. Take a turn, Spider Weaver. Take a turn. Wow, she took a turn. Thank you. So let's use uh, the stun. Of course, Quicksilver has no vulnerabilities. And he died. Okay, great. Uh, let's go after Ebony more. Is he gonna die? Please die. Just die already. Okay, great. Uh, so, she's going to do her special. She's going to do her special, so we have to kill her. Vulnerability to her. We still have charges. Good, good, good. Let's heal up. I can't believe that she one-shotted my Silver Surfer. Just like that, man. Okay, now down to... Spider-Man War, please do funny stuff. Ooh, and she shields up everyone. Oh, that's not good. Flip. And now I lose. 2099 does not flip the town to. And she one shots my weaver. Fucking hell, man. So unlucky today. Really unlucky. You have the stupid noir over there. But no, she has to go after the. That bitch. Okay, please. The, the, the guys just keep getting dead proofs. It's crazy. Okay, big ultimate. Striker is away. He's going to revive, I hope. 
It, what's up with this Gwenpool? She takes no damage. Is she like level 1 billion or what? Level 97, 2 diamonds and she takes no damage. She has no buffs, she has nothing. Seriously, what's up today with this shit war, man? How is she not taking any damage? Are the top uh, leaders in Alliance Wars play to win? I, I really can't believe, man. I really can't believe this Deadpool one shots my entire team. Should I have used Mbaku? Yes, absolutely. I agree. I agree, I should have used Mbaku. I should 100% use Mbaku. So they have leader. They spawn with safeguard. Can go on defense. Oh my god. I just want to go to sleep. It's like, and, and she, not only, not only she one shots, not only she, I, I, it, it baffles me. Not only she one shots the Silver Surfer, her passive attack one shots the Emma Frost as well. Not only the ultimate one shot Silver Surfer, with defense up, with defense up, the passive also one shots Emma Frost. It, it's, it's really, really crazy. Really, really crazy. It's a kind of nonsense. Like losing two characters instantly is the kind of so of nonsense that I, I really can't deal with. Fucking hell, man! Seriously. And they have the armory down. The cargo base on the other side. Man, this water is all kinds of wrong. Armory down. Security in the middle. So, or they have the cargo bay under the bridge, but that would not be very smart. Bye. Yeah, they are boosted on defense, but the amount of damage they are doing is just absurd. They, they spawn with offense up. Is the offense up alone enough to do that much damage? Or is she getting like some kind of boost or something? Okay, I'm going to try to one shot um, Nowhere versus Sinister Six. This works sometimes, not always. Sometimes it works, other times it doesn't. So let's see. It all depends on uh, who scroll rewinds and uh, who gets stunned by Nova. Hopefully it will be a minion. Let's see how it goes. Turn rewind on Dr. Octopus. And he almost dies. Wow. Is he going to die? Dr. Octopus already dead and they stunned Craven, man. Fucking hell. Seriously. What is this shit luck, man? Sh absolute shit luck. Striker has a weight and he kills the Dr. Octopus still. Fortifier, one diamond. For the Skaral, meu. Vulture against, a Vulture against four heroes doesn't take a single turn. Vulture against four heroes doesn't take a single turn. It's really unbelievable. It's really unbelievable. And, and, and the Craven is stunned. Like, Craven stunned, I cannot do anything. With Craven stunned, I cannot do anything. It's really unbelievable. 
Uh, I'm gonna try to one-shot the, the scroll, I guess. So I'm gonna use the special, try to one-shot the scroll. Striker is white. Mysterio now. Uh, I'm going to ultimate with Mysterio. And, and the scroll does not die, bro. The scroll doesn't die. The scroll doesn't die. The scroll doesn't die. It's really unbelievable. I, I don't have anything else to say. It's it's a very fucking small scroll, man. Fucking hell. And he, he goes... Oh my fucking god, really. He doesn't die, man. It, it's really unbelievable. It's really fucking unbelievable, man. This caralho, meu. What's up with this shit today, man? What's up with this shit today? The, the worst RNG possible. They stun Craven, the character that I need. There are eight characters on the field. Eight characters on the field, they stun the one that I need. And then the... the heal blocker, striker as a weight on, uh, on the, the scroll. It's not a seven star scroll, it's just a, a six star scroll. And still the guy doesn't die. Fucking hell, really, it's... <sighs> okay, I'm gonna put Craven in the in the, the corner. Let's see. Maybe I... I unlucky. It's cut, I don't know. Really unbelievable. And turn, turn the wine on Craven, okay. At least he attacked the minion. And now Vulture goes first. Why he didn't go first before? And he stuns... Oh my fucking god! These things! These! Are you fucking kidding me? Are you really? Are you fucking kidding me? Two times in a row. And and now and now the goblin does too much damage to now the go goblin does too much damage to to the scroll. Now the goblin does too much damage to the scroll. And the craven dies again. Three diamonds craven. Three diamonds craven. Dies again. The Green Goblin cannot remove the, the stealth. The dog dies at least. At least uh, the dog dies. Uh, let's remove this guy. He's gonna revive soon. Scroll now with his raptor. Let's go after the the stupid Thor. Slow to the scroll. Of course, of course, the block on the of course block on the slow, of course. Why would it be any difference? Why would it be any different, man? The slow gets blocked, of course it gets blocked. Of course it gets blocked. Why would it be any different? Why would it be any different? Um, special, I don't know. Okay, he dies with the Raider Isolator. All the Mysterio minions die. Why would this be any different? And now I cannot kill this, so I'm just gonna press auto. Well, let's kill at least the, the stone guy. Now I have to time out. I don't know. Maybe Nova has something in his in his kit that stuns a character. Maybe I'm stupid. Maybe Nova has something in his kit that he always stuns the same character. Let's see. 
So at this point, it has to be user error. I guess Novate says always stuns Craven. So we have Craven over there. Nova. Yeah, don't open the arms with that luck. Yeah. So the, does he has like smart AI on the water? Clear all barrier. Attack primary targets as the same targets. On war, create revive once from primary targets and adjacent targets. Attack primary targets and adjacent targets. Apply disrupt. Apply stun to the primary target. In alliance wars, on offense, if this character applies Nova Force, this match, apply bleed to primary targets and adjacent targets. Apply trauma to the primary target. Apply safeguard to the primary target. On defense, characters killed by this ability cannot be revived. So once again, once again, there is nothing on Nova that has special AI to attack Craven. There is literally nothing on Nova special to attack Craven. So it's all based on luck. So we have seven characters. We have seven characters on the field, which makes a 14% chance 14% chance and it happened two times 14% chance it happened two times so 14% multiplied by 0 14 2% chance so 2% chance of this shit that you just saw to happen two times in a row in different positions Craven gets attacked first Scrolled, yeah, yeah. Two times in a row. It is two percent chance, guys. Two percent chance. Two percent chance. Back to back, the same character gets stunned. Really unbelievable, man. Really unbelievable. This water, pff, worst water of my life. And we have to do, we have to win in water, or no, we have to participate for the, the Alliance event. Okay, I'm not even going to do extra attacks anymore. Like, the, this water is just ridiculous. Congratulations to the Black Vengeance. Really unbelievable. Two bugs on, on the Hero Asgardians match. Two bugs on the Hero Asgardians match. Then, two times attacked on Kraven. It's really unbelievable. Shadow, the world is Tony. Dodger, what's up, guys? Welcome back. I apologize for this maximum rage, but... Uh, yeah, this, this game sometimes can really piss you off. Against all odds. Against all odds. The day my life needs the most... The most help is the day that nothing goes right. It's not that we are not using the right strategy, it's that uh, it always gets the, the bad RNG. It, it's just, it was bad RNG after bad RNG. Okay, maybe I'll be lucky with the orbs, let's see. We have 10x, we have 3 orbs to open. We are still looking for that uh, zombie jugs at uh, 7 yellow. Here you go, first orb. Green, okay. At least we are getting the, the gold orbs. Here we go, second orb. Another green. Another four shards. Four shards, I guess it's the minimum, right? Yeah, the minimum. More gold. Okay, here we go, last orb. Three to one, please. Something that is not green. It's blue. Okay, six shards. So average of five and something. How far are we? 134 out of 300, oof. And we have six more days. Doesn't sound good. Okay, let's open these ones. These ones can drop some good gold. 400k, okay, not the worst. And this one, let's see. Green again. 
And training materials, yikes. And that's it for today, in terms of orbs. So yeah, someone was asking me, how do I do C-theory nowadays without those blue raid orbs? In my opinion, the best orbs to do is the milestone orbs and the elite fours. If you want to do C-theory, you can do it with elite fours. What you want? You want to get in 10 orbs, you want to get like uh, three fives, maybe one six. If you get one six and everything else is four, don't do it. It's better to get three fives than one six in 10 orbs. Little Lazy, welcome back. CC was fine. CC was fine. We have some interesting matches. But man, this war has been terrible so far. We were able to full clear in, uh, in CC. Extreme caused some problems. By Frost was easy. Then the other problem was also Room 6. Room 6, you have to kill it on a very specific order. Otherwise, you can compromise yourself. Uh, but yeah, the Robbie Ray's Raider, don't do it, guys. It's just for you to waste your eyes away. No other reason. Okay, I'm going to leave. It's 2 a.m. already here. And uh, I need to wake up early tomorrow. Rocky Sands. Oh my god, I apologize. I need to leave. It's already super late here. It's already 2 in the morning. Now with the summer uh, schedule. With the, the time change. I don't remember how to say the time change. I apologize. It always gets very, very late here. But anyway, guys. Good luck with your Cosmic Crucible. And with your Wars. We'll be back tomorrow for the last match. If we win, we might face Pathfinder. If we lose, we might also face Pathfinder. So we'll see. Okay, guys. Wish you guys a good night. And we'll catch you guys later. Take care.